because of safety of the of judges and the last <laughs> section is the Malachim. The last few chapters it speaks about the days of Mashiach. Okay, now have everybody's attention. Thank you. And in that day, day in that time, when Mashiach comes, will not be any uh, hunger or famine or war. There won't be any jealousy. There will be abundance of good. All um, pleasures will be found like, uh, will be available like the dust of the earth. The entire world will be involved in just knowing the knowledge of Hashem. Therefore, the hidden will be great sages. They will know the hidden secrets. They will comprehend the knowledge of their creator based on a person's ability. Shinamar, as the Pasuk reads in Isaiah, the world will be filled with the knowledge of God as the water covers the ocean, as the water covers the ocean. This concludes the entire section of Malachim and the entire set of the Raman. Blessed be Hashem uh, individually and collectively. That's the end, and now we go right away to the beginning, just like we do on Tufa Seir. Um, it starts with the four letters of Hashem. Yisayda, Yisayda, Yisramuda, Chafmeis. Leida, the foundations of all foundations and the pillars of wisdom is to know the Shayesh and Matsi Rishim. There is something which made everything happen. And Hashem is the one that makes everything come into existence. And everything that's found from heaven to earth. And everything that's in between. Comes and exists from this true being. It's the end of the seum to explain something of the... Uh, there's no bar pop or anything, but... Uh, um, Rabbi Goldstein should have said it.